again and welcome to another unboxing of Loot Crate. Finally received the uh, new Loot Crate here for January. This month's theme is Invasion. So let's see what invaded my mailbox today in the Loot Crate. Just got this a little bit ago so as you can see it is still sealed up. I haven't had a chance to open it yet. Okay, of course with every box you got some cool artwork on the inside there and well check this out it's a shirt and the shirt is Ta -da! it's an X-Files shirt yay which is pretty cool says the X-Files right there in the tag, so you know it's an X-Files shirt, and this is pretty cool. Well, especially with uh, X-Files coming back again on Fox TV, so it's going to be cool to see that show again with Mulder and Scully running around trying to figure out what's going on with the aliens and everything. But yeah, this is a really cool shirt. I really like the look and the design of it. Something I could actually wear uh, more than once over the holiday seasons, like what I... Like what I can do with the uh, one from last month, the uh, holiday shirt. Yeah, this one here is be pretty cool. I can wear that anywhere and whenever I want. Not limited to the holiday season. So yeah, X-Files shirt is pretty kicking right there. Awesome. Like that. And let's see what else we got. We've got... Ah, I was wondering what the alien thing was going to be. And this is it. It's a alien face hugger plushie. And yeah, just check this thing out. Go ahead. Open this up. Yeah, check it out. It's a little face hugger. Would be kind of cool if they actually had a xenomorph instead of one of these guys. But this guy's pretty cool. And and check him out. He's well hung. So yeah, because of that, I'm not going to be putting him on my face. Anyway, pretty cool little toy. Maybe the cat can have some fun playing with this one here. But unfortunately, my cat's name is not Jones or Jonesy. And to continue with the X-Files theme, there's an LED flashlight that says X-Files on it. So yay! Got another little flashlight there to use. Cool. And a giant rubber band. Hmm. Oh. Haha, -ha, missed. Okay, and oh, batteries for the flashlight. And, oh, here we go. Space Invaders. You got a nice little mini alien vinyl figure. I've got the little yellow guy. Cool little thing. And set that up on your monitor like so. really like it when you have little figures in here. The figures are pretty cool. Nice little collectible items. Oh, let's see. For the fifth element, there's the uh, multi-pass. Hmm. wonder if you can actually take that thing out. So let's see. Fulston Paradise Special Flight Multi-Pass. Includes plastic card sleeve. You can put your ID badge or something in there, maybe. Eh, let's open it up and find out. So yeah, you take the multi-pass app, put your identification card in there, slide it in, and hey, got a multi-pass in case you have like a badge or something you gotta wear at work. You can put that in there. You can be cool. And then of course the uh, loot pin. This one here is uh, looks like a little alien. There, he's got a little he's got a little crate in his hand. 
Invasion of the Mini Prince. War of the Worlds, can't go wrong with that. Classic invasion movie right there. Not the new one, the new one was terrible. Uh, the Day the Earth Stood Still, another classic one. Awesome invasion movie. Not the new one, the new one was terrible. And that's it. Too many prints, yay! And then of course, you can't forget the Loot Crate Mini Magazine. So let's see what it says about that rubber band. That was really a really weird item to have in there. Anyway, that's the Loot Crate for January 2016. Invasion is the theme, so Hope you, get, hope you get a kick out of it there if you get one. And I know I like the shirt in there. The Space Invader guy is cool. The Fifth Element badge holder is going to be pretty cool. You can use that at work. So, uh, yeah. What was your favorite loot crate? Mine was, uh, mine was the December one. Anyway, thanks for watching. Keep watching again as I open up more of these things. I don't know how long I'm going to keep my subscription going there, but this one here was, uh, was well worth it, so I'm pretty pleased with it. We'll have to see what next month's theme is before I decide if I really want to continue on or not. But, yeah, again, January Loot Crate is pretty kicking. Thanks for watching.